I saw a tweet about Microsoft Font Maker and how you can design your own font. And it gave me an idea that people could make a secret code. Students could have some fun during the summer playing with Microsoft tools by making their own secret code. Now, of course, it would be easily decodable by just changing the font, but still they could have some fun like they're creating their own language. To download Microsoft Font Maker, you'll need to go to the Microsoft Store in Windows 10. It's a free app. Click the Install button at the top. Once it's done installing, go ahead and click the Launch button. It will bring up this screen. Now all you need to do is write what you want for each letter in each individual box. When you're ready, start creating your alphabet. I enjoy the Harry Potter books, so maybe for the H, I'm going to use the Deathly Hallows symbol. Since I like Disneyland and Mickey Mouse, for the M, I might create a Mickey Mouse symbol. As a teacher, I used to use touch math, so I might turn my numbers into touch math symbols. You can use whatever you want. Once you're done creating all your letters, numbers, and symbols, you could click Save and work on it later, or go ahead and click Next. On this page, you're going to write out these sentences. I went ahead and wrote them out in traditional writing to see how it handled my symbols from the previous page. Now go to Next, and here it shows your secret code. What I like about this page is you can adjust the space between the characters or the space between the words. And I appreciate that for accessibility. Some people appreciate more spacing between their words. And I can also adjust the size. And now I go to the top corner. Once you click Create, you choose where to save your font. Personally, I like to save to my desktop because it makes it easy to find my secret code and save. And now you can go ahead and close Windows Font Maker. Now that your font is created, we need to add it to the fonts folder. Open your control panel and go to the fonts folder. Simply take your font off the desktop and drag it into that area. And now your font is installed. Let's test it out and see how my secret code font worked. I've opened Word and I'll type a quick sentence. Highlight the sentence and let's look and see if my font appeared. So I had called it My Secret Code, so I'm going to go down to the M's. And you'll notice not only is it there, it's there written in my secret code. And there's my new sentence. Let's make it larger. There's my secret code, and when I need to read it again, I simply highlight it, choose an actual font, and there's my sentence. I hope you enjoy this quick tip of how to use Windows Font Maker.